Hi friends, welcome to my channel, The Fragrance Kingdom. If this is your first time, we talk about perfumes in this channel from an Indian perspective, from an Indian person who, you know, gives you a sort of like an insight of the perfumes at work in a hot, humid climate and, um, you know, how perfumes behave and what are my favorites and things like that. And if you've been watching my videos, please like them please hit the subscribe button and also activate the notification bell so whenever i put a video on a new perfume you're able to see that first um if you can see i'm back into the window it is uh, it, it's been raining since morning and it just kind of puts me in a completely different mood i love 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 the rains um you know it's also a very special day today it's my sister's birthday so we've been just kind of hanging around and spending some time together and again i'm in in the city you know i can watch the city from the window look at the gloominess and the city passing by with everything that's happening i think life just goes on right we've got a we're all kind of anxious to get back to life we'll see what happens we'll see Meanwhile, uh, like I promised, I'm going to continue to talk about some perfumes that are kind of easy to wear, not like big, loud perfumes, simple, and something that kind of evokes like, you know, intimacy or coziness and things like that. So I have for you a perfume from beautiful bottle obviously <laughs> but the perfume is from valentino and the perfume's name is valentina now when i kind of looked up it's crazy i don't know when they changed it to just a single flower but i think what they had was like three little flowers for for valentina and they have um, now just a single flower but i think the notes are similar i have no idea what they've changed because they've changed the flower though. they've changed the flower it used to be three flowers it's just one flower now okay so this one belongs to my sister and she is like we have very uh, some of the perfumes that we instantaneously both of us like and there's like her choice is completely different from mine so i think i just kind of again talk about diversity and how different we are how you know different perfumes work for us what works for me may not work for her in fact there's one perfume that i really really enjoy but she she couldn't stand it she couldn't like she was like no way so we're different people we like different things and different notes kind of make us feel different things so today i'm reviewing valentina from valentino or by valentino the house of valentino the big big fashion house you know beautiful stuff um and we'll see how this perfume reviews for me so i'm going to spray it in the air right now whoopsie it's a very big spray hmm I know it's very delicate because, you know, I smelt it, um, I sprayed it a couple of times, you know, since I've been here. It's a very delicate perfume. What can I say about this? Okay, so first off, I think it is something that I've smelled definitely before. It's not unique in any way. Um, it is definitely a floral perfume. What else can I get from it? There is a little bit, a slight woodiness to it, but that's like, you know, a very, very small kind of proportion in all the flowers that I can smell right now. What else can I think of it? So actually, I would wear this perfume to places like, um, you know, something where it's a very composed environment. Um, maybe to a place of worship, to church, I would wear this even to bedtime because it's pretty delicate. It's very mild florals. It's got a couple of vibes to be like, it's got that, I don't want to say pleasures, but like the hope, um, not hope, happy, like thinly, I think slightly, but it's more muted and it's more kind of leaning towards, uh, you know, there's, there's something in it that kind of takes it away from that. 
where else would I wear this perfume? I would also wear it for like, you know, just uh, being by myself or if I'm just going to the library. I'm so boring, right? I wasn't, okay, I wasn't boring. <laughs> so we just change with, with different things in life, right? We go through different phases and we become different people and we enjoy different things. So yes, if I had to go to the library, if I had to go to university, that's what I would, you know, wear very uh, delicate, very simple, very uh, kind of classy because, uh, like I said, it's it's uh, it's floral and it's uh, almost kind of uh, slight woodiness. There is something that I'm getting of it, but I can't really place it. Let's quickly read the notes and see what it says. Um, okay, I did. <laughs> I did do this research. There's truffle in it, okay? So when you think of truffle, you're thinking of like all things sweet. You know, we've, we've had truffle chocolates. We've got truffle cakes. And I really didn't know what truffle was. And I was looking through and I was like, let me see what truffle is. And it is actually a fungus, okay? A fungus that grows uh, organically. You can't really grow it. Very expensive. Uh, mostly in the European region, there's black truffle and there's white truffle. Um, so that's what there is in this and there's supposed to be like a sweetness yet like a earthiness to it so I think that's what I'm getting as well from this perfume like a sweet earthiness like a root maybe I'm not sure let's see what the other notes are bergamot so there is a fruit in it but it's I didn't get any fruity in this I'm trying to spray it again Oh my god, I sprayed it right in my, oh my god, I'm so sorry, the spray was right in my face, it just went all over my face and my nose. Okay, I'm gonna have a burning face now. Uh, the middle notes are strawberry, jasmine, tuberose, African orange flower. So there is fruity, you know, fruity notes in this, like strawberry. I'm getting the sweetness from the strawberry, it's not a tartiness, but you know, I get like that juiciness from the strawberries yes i do that I, I do get that jasmine again very mild i have a couple of jasmine perfumes and you know that's for later that's for later tuberose african orange flower and then there's base notes are uh, vanilla amber and virginia cedar so i think i get the woody notes from the virginia cedar right up front like you know there's a mix of this uh floral notes with like a really you know delicate woody note vanilla i don't know what the dry down will be like i do know i do remember it doesn't change too much like it doesn't transition way way too much but yes it stays simple it stays very classy it stays fruity sorry it stays floral uh, with a little bit of sweetness that kind of shines through all throughout right there's no tartiness uh, from the strawberries definitely no tartiness or the bergamot I simply get like this very delicate, uh, you know, mix of everything. I haven't really got the earthiness as yet in the fresh opening, but we'll see. I mean, uh, uh, you know, let me know if you have the perfume and what you think of it. But yes, I think this is a, a very um, beautiful, you know, just for yourself kind of perfume. You don't have to announce it to anybody. It's not like, you know, I'm here kind of perfume. It's just something for you to enjoy. You can wear it with... Uh, you're just your casual, so you can wear it with, at home after a bath or something like that. Okay, it um, it does remind me of slightly of of you know Happy by Clini, but uh, it's still different. But it's just that same vibe, you know, same vibe, Happy vibe. <laughs> okay, that's it for me. Um, stay tuned. Please, please, please support me by hitting the like button, subscribing, and also, you know, uh, activating the notification bell. And also, please comment, you know, I'd love to interact. I'm, you know, I'm doing this uh, for all of you. I enjoy it as well. So, you know, let's interact. Let's see what you have to say about perfumes in the Indian context. We all, you know, we're all different people and we feel differently let's let's see what the fragrance means to you so if you have it i'd love to hear some comments from you about it that's it for now we had a nice rainy day we still have a little cloudy cloudy i don't know if you can see the skies gray skies laden with some rain to come a little later 
and I am <laughs> happy that it's raining. <laughs> and I hope you're happy too wherever you are. Take care. See you soon. Bye-bye.